we definitely need preservative in order to preserve it because already you have added water this skin glowing shower gel is specially made for my customer who ordered for it she said that she prefers shower gel to uh, soap bar so i decided to do with just one shower gel but there's something i want you guys to learn in this one which is not in the other one so please i want you to watch so this is a plain shower gel you can use any shower gel of your choice yes what we are doing is to augment our product to suit our skin and our need so i have emptied this shower gel and uh, uh, i'm now going to start adding the ingredients based on her skin type so instead of adding water in order to melt the powder the fruit powder that i'm using i scooped part of the shower gel in order to use it to melt the fruit powder so as not to allow lumps in it so you can see i've added carrot powder i've added beetroot powder now i am adding citrus peel powder so this is honey as well because that my customer she needs kind of um a uh, product to blend in her skin because she has a sensitive skin so right now i am melting it i am trying to work on it to melt all the lumps to just make the consistency the same thing because if you do it in the whole shower gel you might not be able to get it right that's why i scoop part of it in order to use it to melt all the um um the powder so i've added um vitamin e oil i added two capsules then i have to work on it to mix everything together i'm very very sure that this my customer will like it so if you have done the shower gel that i taught you before this one will be better because the other one i used water to melt the powder and when you use water to melt the powder you will definitely need preservative in order to preserve it because already you have added water but right now we are not adding any liquid we are only adding solid things like the powder so it will not change the consistency of this shower gel so make sure you mix it very well so that all the ingredients will go inside uh, the shower gel so when you finish it like that you just pour it back or you put it in the can which you like to use so i'm just putting it back in here and then getting it ready to send it to my customer so i decided to share this thing with you guys so for people who melt their uh powder product with water do not do that again unless you have preservative to add and you know i try everything to leave these things as natural as possible so that's why i don't like using preservative so with this you don't need preservative just do it like that and then you're good to go so hopefully my customer will enjoy this so if you can do it but if you want me to do for you you can order as well just give me a dm and then tell me exactly your type of body and what you want and then i'll do it for you so look at it very beautiful see you in my next video